name is Jane. Right now, I'm a student at the Fashion Institute of Technology and I'm majoring in fashion design. I chose fashion design because it's always been my passion ever since I was a kid. And my mom and my grandma, they've always been very interested in fashion, but they never like believed in themselves to the point where they would rather pursue something else to make bread. So I feel like I can make it, so I am taking that leap of faith to pursue the industry. So my favorite designers are Vivian Westwood, obviously, and then Tom Brown. I love Tom Brown. Their tailoring is so good. I think that's like my dream job for now. I would really love to work for Tom Brown or Ralph Lauren in New York City. And then I also really like Chapova Lowena. They're very punk and they're actually sustainable too. And then I like Sandy Liang, Simone Rocha, and Shushu Tong. Take a lot of inspiration from my daily life. I'm a very emotional person. I mean, I would say that my actions don't are, aren't really like based off of emotion but I feel emotions very deeply for example if I listen to a specific song like the first song that I'll listen to that'll be like my entire mood so lately I've been listening to a lot of techno so yeah I think it's kind of weird because it's music but for some reason I can see patterns <laughs> like does it make sense into techno I think of pleats so lately, I've been very into geometrical shapes and a lot of tiny pleats details. This is a skirt that I made. It's a wraparound skirt. It's very cute. It's not pressed, but it was cuter before. But anyways, this collection is called, I mean, this look is called Preppy Punks. And it's inspired by the song by Gorillaz called Feel Good Inc. And I don't know, I just feel like that song, it like really, I don't know, I just feel emotions when I listen to that song. And the emotions that I feel is very like playful and a little bit like rebellious too. So I use plaids and then this is um, satin rayon. Mm -hmm. It's Vera Wang's leftover. And then this is just like, a normal wool. I don't have like a routine that I religiously follow but I do like see a pattern. I usually start off by sketching very very loose sketch without croquis on like just plain white paper and then I'll see which texture I like. Like for example like I said I've been liking pleats so every time I see like geometric shapes and the pleats on my designs on my loose sketch i open pinterest and like find more similar looking references yeah and then i'll like select a theme after that my favorite part of doing fashion design would probably be draping and pattern making because i think it's very fits like how the clothes fit your bodies are like very important and you can like adjust that by draping and pattern making. Which collection of your design that you most proud of? I think it would be the one I'm working on right now. It's for my visual design and concepts class. And I'm making this collection about like souls. Basically about like finding your soul's purpose in life. It's like existential crisis. <laughs>
confession. Probably because of my current environment, because I'm at FIT, like, it's a prestigious school for fashion design. So I thought I'm, like, a hard worker, but, like, everyone here are, like, hard asses. They're, like, they will do everything. Like, I'm not that special. So that's why I feel like I have to work hard. But lately, it's been, like, <laughs> I've been working hard, but since I'm like so stressed, I've been going out a lot and like spending time for myself, like having fun. And I feel kind of guilty for doing so because I haven't done that in a long time. 